Have you ever paused in the middle of your busy day and asked yourself, what is the purpose of my life? What am I striving for? These are questions as old as humanity itself, questions that philosophers have grappled with for centuries. Today we turn to one such philosopher, Seneca, a man who not only contemplated these profound questions, but also provided insightful answers. Seneca, one of the great Stoic philosophers of ancient Rome, believed that the quest for a meaningful life didn't reside in external accomplishments or material wealth. Instead, it's an inward journey, an exploration of one's character and virtues. In this video, we delve into Seneca's wisdom to help us navigate the tumultuous seas of life and discover our own path to meaning. Stay with us as we unveil the philosophical pearls from one of the greatest minds in human history. Lucius Aeneas Seneca, known as Seneca the Younger, was a towering figure of the ancient world. Born in Corduba in Hispania, today's Spain, he rose to prominence in Rome as a statesman, orator, and notably, a philosopher. Seneca was part of the Stoic school of thought, a philosophy that encouraged virtue, wisdom, and ethical conduct as the primary goals of life. Throughout his life, Seneca wrote extensively on various aspects of Stoicism, developing a rich repertoire of ideas. His works, which included letters, essays, and tragedies, touched upon a wide range of themes, from duty and ethics to the transience of life and the acceptance of fate. But perhaps one of his most profound contributions lay in his perspectives on life's purpose and meaning. In a world often driven by the pursuit of power and wealth, Seneca's words provide a stark contrast, inviting us to delve deeper and find meaning within ourselves. Seneca's philosophy towards life is deeply ingrained in Stoicism, shaped by a powerful sense of practicality and realism. He viewed life not merely as a passage of time, but as a finite resource to be wisely spent. Seneca is famously quoted saying, Life is long if you know how to use it. According to him, it wasn't the shortness of life that made it precious, but rather our misuse of it. Seneca emphasized the transient nature of life, urging his followers to live each day as if it were their last. This was not a call to reckless abandonment, but rather a perspective to appreciate the present moment and not let life slip away in pointless distractions. One of Seneca's core ideas was the concept of living according to nature. To Seneca and the Stoics, living according to nature meant aligning one's life and actions with rationality and virtue. It meant understanding the laws of the universe, accepting them, and living in harmony with them. Perhaps most importantly, Seneca believed in finding purpose and fulfillment through virtue and wisdom. This ties into his view of the Stoic good life, where moral character and inner peace take precedence over material wealth and societal status. According to Seneca, it is by focusing on what is in our control, our actions, our responses, our values, that we can imbue our lives with meaning and purpose. According to Seneca, the path to meaning in life lies not in external achievements or possessions, but in cultivating our inner virtues and fulfilling our potential as rational beings. He believed in the transformative power of philosophy, viewing it not as a mere intellectual exercise, but as a practical guide for leading a meaningful life. Seneca wrote extensively on the idea of virtue being the highest good. He suggested that the pursuit of virtue, qualities such as wisdom, courage, justice, and temperance, brings about a state of tranquility and fulfillment, a state the Stoics referred to as eudaimonia. One of his most famous quotes, it is not the man who has too little, but the man who craves more, that is poor, underlines his philosophy that contentment and simplicity pave the way to a rich and meaningful life. For Seneca, craving more, whether it be wealth, status, or even time, distracts us from appreciating what we have and living in the moment. Seneca also emphasized the importance of fulfilling our potential. In his writings, he encouraged the idea of self-improvement and lifelong learning. He believed that each of us has unique strengths and talents, and it is our duty to nurture and utilize them to contribute to the common good. And finally, Seneca advocated for contributing to the common good as a path to a meaningful life. He urged individuals to act not only for their benefit, but for the benefit of society at large. This sense of connectedness and contribution, according to Seneca, was instrumental in deriving a sense of purpose and fulfillment in life. 
Turning Seneca's philosophical ideas into practical steps, we can derive a roadmap to infuse our lives with meaning. Here's how we can apply his wisdom. Pursue virtue. Begin by identifying and cultivating virtues such as wisdom, courage, justice, and temperance in your daily life. Strive to make ethical decisions, treat others with kindness and fairness, and foster resilience in the face of adversity. Embrace simplicity. Simplify your life by focusing on what truly matters. This could mean decluttering your physical space, managing your time more effectively, or reducing your desires and ambitions to align with your true needs. Fulfill your potential. Identify your unique strengths and talents and invest time and energy in nurturing them. This might involve seeking further education, honing a skill, or taking on challenges that help you grow. Contribute to the common good. Find ways to use your abilities to contribute to society or aid others. This could be as simple as volunteering in your local community, helping a colleague or friend, or working on projects that aim to make a positive impact. Practice mindfulness. Finally, remember Seneca's teachings about the value of the present moment. Practice mindfulness, savoring the present and resisting the urge to constantly chase after the future. By adopting these practices inspired by Seneca's philosophy, we can start the journey towards a life filled with greater purpose and meaning. It's not an instant transformation, but a lifelong process of self-discovery and growth. Leading a life imbued with meaning and purpose can transform us in profound ways. Seneca himself serves as a powerful example of this transformation. Despite his times of political intrigue and personal trials, he remained committed to his stoic principles, shaping his experiences into lessons of wisdom and resilience. Having a clear sense of purpose can provide us with direction, acting as a guiding compass in our decision-making processes. It helps us understand where we should invest our energy and what we should let go, reducing unnecessary stress and inner conflict. When we live a life of meaning, we're likely to experience a higher level of satisfaction and contentment. Seneca teaches us that the pursuit of virtue and wisdom, more than any external accomplishment or possession, is what gives life its deepest sense of fulfillment. Moreover, a meaningful life fosters resilience. As Seneca's life demonstrates, when we're driven by a greater purpose, we can better navigate life's storms. We see challenges not as insurmountable obstacles, but as opportunities for growth and self-improvement. And finally, finding meaning in life can lead to a greater sense of connection with others and the world around us. By striving to contribute to the common good, we extend our sense of purpose beyond our individual selves, fostering a sense of belonging and unity. So, as we apply Seneca's teachings to our own lives, we're not just learning how to infuse our days with a sense of purpose. We're opening ourselves to a more profound, satisfying, and resilient way of being. In today's journey through the philosophy of Seneca, we have discovered the rich depth of his Stoic wisdom, particularly his insights on finding meaning in life. From understanding our mortality to realizing our potentials and contributing to the common good, Seneca's teachings offer us a profound roadmap to a life filled with purpose. This journey, however, is more than just an intellectual exercise. It invites us to introspection and action. It asks us to question our current pursuits and priorities, to reflect on our values and how we spend our time. It encourages us to live each day with intention and virtue, to seek wisdom, and to contribute positively to the world around us. Remember, the journey to a meaningful life doesn't have to be grand or dramatic. It starts right here, right now, with small steps of intentionality and awareness. It begins with the understanding that every moment is an opportunity to choose, to grow, and to add something of value to the world. As Seneca once wrote, as long as you live, keep learning how to live. And in this constant learning, in this intentional approach to living, we find not just the meaning of life, but the beauty and joy of it too. So, I invite you to ponder on Seneca's philosophy, to reflect on its relevance to your own life. I encourage you to take up the journey of a meaningful life and embrace the transformative power it holds. Thank you for joining me on this exploration of Seneca's philosophy. Until next time, keep seeking, keep questioning, and keep growing.